DP. Let's see who we can find today. So just bumped into Steve Turner. What's it like being back home for the GP then? Yeah, it's good. Uh, we've had a uh, few G last couple of GPs we haven't fared too well, so uh, hopefully a home GP will put on a good performance for everybody. So uh, yeah, weather's good. A bit of rain forecast for tomorrow, but hopefully it'll be a good weekend. And uh, the track's looking good. So uh, yeah, it should be good, hopefully. Now joined by Hugh Thomas. Now Hugh's the man behind Monster this weekend. He's planned everything. So Hugh, what are we looking forward to this weekend in regards with Monster? So we have the two rigs open all weekend in the public and the paddock areas of the grounds. Um, we're going to have the Monster Girls on site doing what they do best, looking lovely, taking Polaroid photos, interacting with everyone here. And then in the evenings on Friday and Saturday night, we've got a huge party for the first time for us at the GP on this very rig behind us, which will be used as a stage. And we've got two times UK DMC DJ champion, JFB, who'll be cutting and scratching and generally making us dance. And we've also got the Mad Crew, who is Monster After Dark program, doing some fire breathing and some angle grinding. Generally looking pretty rad, so should be a good party. Cool, we look forward to party with you. Hugh, thanks for your time, have a good weekend. Right. I'm now with Dan from Moto. So we're at our home stand now. How's it been, Dan? How's the trade been going? How's the crowd been? Uh, it's been good, they've been really friendly. Lots of people know the magazine already and coming up and subscribing but yeah it's been really good so far perfect so what have we got going on today then what are you doing here uh, there's a couple of things really the first is subscription offers so come up to the stand today you can subscribe for a year to the magazine and take away two new moto t-shirts or a moto hoodie uh, and we're also doing if you come up and buy either the latest issue or a t-shirt or a subscription you get to have a go in our lucky dip yeah, you can win loads of prizes from uh, goodie bags to boxes of Mam Sweets to DC caps, uh, all sorts. Yeah, yeah. Brilliant. Well, have a good rest of the weekend. I'm sure we'll catch up with you soon. So we're at Slush Rush at the top of the hill here. So what's your favourite slush and what is the best seller? Red Bull's my favourite and raspberry and strawberry is the best sellers. So we're in the factory Honda awning. The bikes are looking pretty trick. No Nagel this weekend, but we will keep an eye out for Bobrashev on the track. I'm here with Phil Mercer. So Phil raced yesterday, had a bit of a crash, didn't you, Phil? How was that? <laughs> um, it was pretty difficult. I can't remember too much about it, really. Just um, the, the lead kept changing and everything. But um, I just came up behind Matt's and uh, hit neutral on the face of the jump. And I was going too fast to stop it in time. So it was just time to get off the front. Lunchtime here at Masley Basin. I'm sat with the beautiful girls, like, having, a, having a little break in the sunshine. Are you enjoying yourselves, girls? Yeah, it's lovely, nice and sunny. Yeah, there's a lot of spectators here, so I think it's going to be a good day. Yeah, I'm just looking forward to watching the EMX 250 and cheering on my brother Jordan, so it should be good. Cool. Woohoo! Woo <laughs> okay, I'm joined now with Alex Snow. So, if anybody does follow Alex on Twitter or Instagram, you'll recently seen some of his pictures. His new profession is horse riding. Is this true, Alex? It is, it is. Well, you know, the old motocross has had a bit of absence for a little while, hasn't it, with the old injury, so I need to take up something new, keep life interesting, so uh, old girlfriend Jazzy there was struggling, so she needed someone to show her how to do it. Oh, uh, well, we all know as well, you have been out with injuries a few times this year, so how is it now? Is it feeling better? Are you feeling ready to race tomorrow? Yeah, it's all good as going now. Shoulder's fine, uh, no stress, so I'm quite excited to get out there and get stuck in. Okay, that's the end of day two here at Matley Basin. Uh, the crowd's getting bigger, excitement's growing. So join us tomorrow for another day and we'll see who we can find again. Thanks for watching. Take care now. Bye.